We were on a working vacation because we are able to work remotely. So we have packed the house up. We have the laptop. It looks different over here. Yeah, it do look different. Oh, they're like, I think they're renovating out here. I see tubs and... Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, we're out here at our resort. Like just changing up the scenery and whatnot because why not? But we're on our way to... <clears throat> God, they're on the speed uh. bones. But we're on our way to Farm Fresh. So I wanted to get some um, keto ice cream because I didn't want to travel with it. So that's where we're going. We might take y'all with us. Yeah, 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 yeah. High key, I know. I send all of my rap foes like they my tadpoles. Yeah, yeah. I just had to go crack now on my deep Yeah, yeah, that Draco doesn't like free throws. I do not miss no shots. I got the cheek. Y'all boys be a real extra with the gloves. That's, that's, that's tuna salad. Oh. My bad. Yeah. Try to get y'all content. He give her just a tuna. Some more? Uh, a little bit more. Well, I feel like I'm working the deli. Yeah. Is that put enough, man? Put a little tuna salad on the side. A little tuna salad on the side. Well, why you scoop it to the side when you could have put used all side? Pass them out. All right. Your boy's just extra. <laughs> <laughs> so most definitely had to get the crackers to go with that. Go with that, John. Which one you want? Right here, man. Right here, always. Hey y'all, look what they still got. In February, they still got these. All right, y'all, we Ooh. back. Listen, yeah, we, we on the second we, flow. Yeah, we paying, yeah. Long. And this ain't a short second flow. It's a whole, it's a long way up Yeah, there. yeah. <laughs> it's one of them steep second flow, second flow. But anyway, so I got my halo top. I got the sea salt to caramel. Yeah. And I got the vanilla bean because I wanted to do Kind of like a little miniature hot fudge sundae, but where's my freaking fudge? Here we go. So I got the sugar-free hot fudge sundae. Don't pay my ash any mind, it's real. <laughs> and I did the beef stew, brought that with us. Stanley wants some biscuits to go with it. Yes, sir. So he also got some M&Ms, and y'all already know, mm. he got his cookies and cream ice cream. And he got some Doritos, got some crackers, so we can snack on this chicken salad and this tuna salad. Forgot all about cheese yeah. I packed today. And he needs some rubbing alcohol. But black people love alcohol. And then I saw this wine-based margarita mix yeah. in Target probably about six months ago, and I got it. Took it down my mother-in-law's house and we sipped on that and it was really good. Yeah. Um, it didn't taste artificial or nothing. So I said, well, let me see that. When I saw it in there, I was like, let me get that again. I like that. But that's that's it. Yeah, they got all of our uh, work equipment that um, Lynette was talking about right here that needs to be set up. A light right here for the, for the random TV reviews and random TV reviews, Mike right there. And you know we had to bring the tunes because we got to listen to some music while we're down here too, man. Want some of that chicken salad, buddy, and some crackers, man. All right. And tomorrow we're going to go out because yeah. it's a place that every time we come down here, it's almost like we don't have enough time to do some of the things that we keep wanting to do. Yeah. We wanted to eat at this place called Second Street. Is it Second Street? Yeah, Beach Second Street. Yeah, Second Street, yeah. And we made up in our minds that come a hell of high water, we're going to Second Street tomorrow. Yeah, we doing that thing. Yes, indeed. And I'm tired. Does my face look fat? Your face do not look fat. There we go. Look, look y'all. I got to rant real quick. I got my nails done two weeks ago. Do y'all see a problem? Y'all see a problem. So I'm gonna have to tell my guy, like, listen, I ain't trying to spend all this money. And by the time I come see you again, I look like I've been in a fight. Like, what's up? 
Houston, we have a problem. Yeah, let them know. Oh, I'm gonna let them know. Let them know. Oh, I'm gonna let them. You gotta let them know. But I hope y'all done enjoyed y'all's President's Day off, man. Cause we sure have. We really did take the day off. Yeah. I answered a few emails, um, a few inquiries, but when it came down to like touching and officially processing payments, and ain't do none of that today. None of that. And it felt good. All right, let's crack open this. Uh, crack open this uh, well, chicken me, salad, Mike. Let me um wash the my hands. Um, chicken salad is not bad. It's definitely different, and you would think that it's not seasoned because it's so white. I don't know what seasoning they use on it, but it is seasoned, and it's probably from the rotisserie chicken itself because it is seasoned. But it just looks real white. But I think I like the tuna salad better. That's good. That's good stuff right there. So we about to eat, eat. How it taste yeah. mm -hmm. Something just changed about it. Yeah, it is different. But it's good. But it's something different. Yeah. Y'all, I think we're working too hard while we on vacation, man. We are. We really are. <laughs> well, y'all can see the 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 workstation is is all the way set up, and then we got the setup over here for the camera for the reviews all set up. We done disorientated their whole setup around here. But here's the thing, <laughs> I told Stella, I said well, we were walking up in here with all this equipment. I said, you couldn't have told these neighbors right here we weren't about to set up a porn. Yeah. Like, this is the especially, only thing. Especially with that, that, that light cover right there. Because Stanley didn't break the light down. down. He didn't break the light down. <laughs> and I'm sitting here like, they really, this is an OnlyFans moment, like, for real. Yeah. Run it. But who says? <laughs> I was trying to get the Bel Air review up on YouTube and down here. The internet has not been the best, but we're trying to make do with it. But yeah, I was telling the fam, the internet hasn't been the best down here. It ain't because <laughs> it's the worst. Yeah. <laughs> well, honestly, we've been using our hotspot from our phones because we don't trust yeah. that they're encrypting everything that they need to encrypt. And we don't need them kind of issues. We down here working for real. Like this ain't no play play. So yeah, get ready to heat that up. Yep. Put it on low and slow. Y'all probably was like, didn't y'all tell us that y'all was going to the yeah. Second Street restaurant tonight? Yes, we were, but we forgot that we still have to do Queens of Napa. Kings, uh, of, Kings, Napa. I said Queens of Napa. <laughs> Kings of Napa tonight, so we're gonna go tomorrow night. Yeah, because tomorrow night will be free. 
We've already recorded two reviews today. Yeah. One more to go. Yeah. So we're like, yeah, today is a heavier day than tomorrow will be. So yeah, we're just switching it around. Yeah. Ain't no big thing. Making it work, making it work, making it work. I was looking on the menu too and I still don't know what I want. I wonder, are y'all that, are you like that? Put that down in the comments. Like if you know you're going somewhere, do you like pre-vet out the menu? To I make sure I do. To make sure you still want to go? <clears throat> I, I, yeah, because yeah. because I hate getting to the restaurant and don't and, and don't see nothing on the menu that I like. Mm. I'm so kind of there so with you, this now because I'm like, I love crab cakes, but why is the crab cakes fifty dollars? Oh, it yeah? better be the biggest, lumpiest, no filler crab cake ever. I will oh, pay for good food. Oh, the food. flavor better be there too. Yeah, like I'll pay for food now. Don't get it twisted. <sighs> But for fifty dollars, fifty dollars for crab cakes. When I can go up to Captain George and eat uh, all I can eat, yeah, for fifty dollars. Yeah, so mm, I, I don't know about that. Cause that's what the crab cake. Man, and then they do have this thing called um, it's kind of like a Cajun seafood something over a bed of rice, which we can make that here for like twelve ninety nine. Huh? That's thirty dollars. Yeah, because, man, paying $50 for some crab cakes, man? Yeah. Uh, I, I, I don't know I don't know about that. <laughs> Why you stomping your feet, man? <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's because, like, y'all already know. It has know, to be good. Y'all already know, like, these restaurants, ever since the pandemic been, been um, on the other side of the pandemic, the food hadn't been the same. And, and yeah, I don't, yeah. But at the same time. We've been talking about going to this place for years and still haven't gone. Yeah, we have. Yeah, we have. Oh, now she want to try to go for lunch tomorrow where the prices are a little bit. If you're afraid that the prices is not going to match the quality, at least Look, the man, price will be better. Would y'all would y'all, would y'all, pay $50 dollars for it? I mean, y'all going to see this after the fact. So, y'all, y'all, would y'all pay $50 for some crab cake? And I'm shocked that she said she paid $50 for some crab cake. Because, um, we what y'all didn't know, Lynette is very cheap. No, no, I'm no, not going to no. say cheap. No. She real. likes to get the best prices. Um, and she's really good at it. Yeah. And me, I'm like, let's just go ahead and pay for it. He and, is. And, and, and get it done and over with. She be like, no, I'm going to keep looking until we can get at least 20 or 30% off of this price. That's the queen. Yeah, very Caribbean. Like, we have found, when I had found this place, it was like $350. She was like, nope, I'm gonna get that cheaper than that. So she ended up getting this place for $264. Down from $350. That's what I did. Yeah. <laughs> so I said, go on, do you, go on, do you. I, I used to fight with her. Every now and then I do fight with her, but uh, I used to fight with her even more than that, though. Mm -hmm. And then I get my commission off of that. Yeah. Holla at your people. Look, if you need somebody that's going to, hey, I'm a politician you real quick. If you want a travel agent that's going to work for the people, then it's me. Yeah. Fun travel at gmail.com. I have my information down below. And her expertise is, is Caribbean, Con tra Caribbean, Caribbean travel and, and Carnival cruises. cruises. Yeah. She got you right there. I can do it in my sleep. Yep. Matter of fact, my mentor just sent me over two clients. Ain't it something where you and your mentor trade off clients because her expertise is way different than mine because she's done what I am doing for probably about 30 years and she's just kind of tired of it. She's tired of Caribbean tra um, um, bookings. She's tired of um, the cruise bookings. So when she gets them, she gives them to me. Yeah. <laughs> and when I get anything that's outside of the wheelhouse that I'm, I'm comfortable in, yeah. I give them to her. That's called networking, man. Yes, indeed. Yeah, it works every time. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Stan just asked me how long does it take to cook biscuits. I always go by the instructions, man. Until the ancestors say so. Yeah. Or until, listen, this fingernails drive me crazy. I'd rather have my nails not done at all than to have them done and popping off and breaking. So ghetto. See, man, when you read the directions on the package, you get beautiful biscuits just like that, man. <laughs> and uh, I see somebody uh, put in the comments that if you made a cookbook, that that they buy. Hey, I'll show you think I'm that good. 
That's subjective too. I've been told that she should do a cookbook. I don't think I'm that well of a cook, really. Honestly. It, it ain't what you think, it's what they think. Agreed. <laughs> Cause some chefs can't cook. You got a lady, you ain't slicing them biscuits open and sticking that butter between them, man? Cause you too busy running your mouth, you ain't seen me do it already. Oh, okay. See, okay. see you see that biscuit right there? Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Okay, okay. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, then? It's snowing in feet, man. It's snowing in feet, man. Nah, 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 Hey, look, y'all. Hey, y'all need to tell her she needs to freaking lay off me, man. Cause he over yeah. here, you ain't gonna slice that stuff over there, Mike. Just loud and wrong. <laughs> Just loud and motherfucking wrong. I thought you were being lazy. I ain't seen you putting nothing between. I thought you were being lazy trying to melt the top. Put the butter on the top. Uh, I'll just make sure she's doing it right, y'all. That's all. You just make sure I'm doing something right, but you over here just wrong. Not <laughs> somebody wrong will tell me I'm doing something right. <laughs> ah. Hey y'all, we can we can throw down on this right here, man. We we'll come back and talk to y'all a little bit. We we'll be back. We talk to y'all a little bit. <laughs> I can't stand you. I want you to can't stand you. <laughs> Where you at? Hey, hey, I'll give you ten dollars if you give me the rest of yours. It's more over there. So give, give me the ten dollars. Oh, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> So family, oh my God, it's been a minute since we picked up this camera, but we've been working our tails off as you can see back there. Yeah. But when I tell you this, we do not have a well oiled machine when it comes to working remotely. Well, not yet. <laughs> not <anybody>. yet, but <laughs> we have, we have a lot of, um, we've had a lot of trial and error. We have a lot of things that we know we have to correct. Um, before we do this again, like the working part is no problem. That's gravy. It's the uploading part when we have to do things into YouTube because most people's upload speeds are trash. Mm -hmm. So we actually thought that we were going to have to go to like um, an internet cafe this morning because it was not working. Like it took about 12 hours for a video to upload yesterday in freaking sane. And it's like 30 minutes at home. Yeah. But even today, we're like, okay, we got two more videos to record. The daggone microphone battery went dead. <laughs> so we were like, okay, do they have um, Amazon now down here in this country? Or do, they, not in this country, but in the country area. Or do they have, um, who did you use? Instacart. Instacart. Found Instacart was like, bet, while we cooking breakfast, we can get Instacart to come over here. And Stella started looking at the time in which it took for the stuff to get here and come to find out that they sent the driver 45 minutes away from that store all the way down here to bring us our stuff. Now, our order looked real sus. Yeah. Stanley ordered a two liter Coca-Cola, some nine volt batteries, a two pack of nine volt batteries, and what else did you order? And some Doritos. And some Doritos. Um, definitely, definitely, and and in a secured resort, we're definitely uploading um, OnlyFans content in their mind. I know it. In their mind, them jokers is out here horny, hungry, and they don't ran out of batteries, and they ordering us the cut. We're recording video one of two that needs to be done today. And we take notes on our phone or on our laptop and guess what happened in the middle of recording? Stanley's phone goes dead. And he was like, we gonna run it. And I was like, this will be the one time that we go off task and don't hit no bullet points. And the one thing about doing a YouTube content video, people gonna let you know when you forget something. And I said, I ain't got time for it today. <laughs> I ain't got time. Just, let, just go ahead and let your phone charge up. But here's our scenery for today. But this is how it looks outside today. The golf course is about brown, brown, brown. I don't think I've ever seen it like this out here. Y'all, I think um, I think this place might be haunted or something because we were in our flow 
And the daggone SD card exhausted. Now, come yeah, on now. We, we back now, so let's go ahead and run. We about to run. <laughs> so, y'all, we finally up and out the house, right? Let me tell y'all a story. So, last night, well, all day yesterday, we kept noticing that this truck out here. Now, sometimes it's hard to tell whether a uh, truck's lights or vehicle's lights is on in the daytime or not, because sometimes it could be a reflection from the sun. So, as it got darker, I started to notice that this truck beside me, this white one right here with the hood pop, <laughs> the lights were on. So I was like looking back and forth and I was like, maybe they've been going and coming and I'm just catching it when they, you know, came and the lights haven't gone off yet. So late last night, I looked out the window and noticed that the lights were still on. So I called up to the front desk and asked them if they could um, possibly ring the building next to us because it's not in our building, it's the next door building. And, you know, I said, it's not but so many people out here. Could you ring the units that you know that's occupied and tell them that their lights are on? Because these builders right here, you can't you can't get in the front door unless you got a key. So that's what we are. Like, you key card. You can't even get through the front door. Nope. Then you have to go put your key card in another door to get to the units. So you got two. <laughs> so you have two card um readers to go through the fort you can get in the bill so i knew i couldn't go in there knock on no door and be like hey yo somebody lights on so security came and they looked in the windshield where you're supposed to have right there yep you're supposed to have your piece of paper that says that you can park out here and it has your unit number on it right well they ain't had any one of those in their unit. I mean, in their vehicle. So security was like, okay, you'll have a good surprise in the morning because huh. we're ain't, we ain't doing nothing extra. So the girl called me back last night and told me that. She was like, yep. hey, <laughs> we sent security. They was like, ain't nothing, ain't nothing they can do. So in the morning, you might have a good little show out there because they're not going to be able to start their vehicle in the morning. Well, they are just starting to kind of leave and you, you, you see it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But we're on our way to... The Second Street Bistro. Yeah, my hopefully man. the food is bomb because we about to spin a grip. And I need um, it to be bomb because I'm hungry, man. Me too. And they close at nine, so we said we wanted to get there by six, just in case service is but, slow. But Google was saying it was like 5.9 miles away, but but the uh, thing said it's seven miles. It still ain't it's it's still like, ain't bad. No, but it's like two mile difference. Yeah, <laughs> you don't got real city right now. Yeah, man. Don't slip on the trail. Don't slip on the trail. Tip ho, tip ho. Alright, you can go for my tip ho. You know, just sing it alone. Yes, indeed. Yeah, man, y'all see those thot popping shrimp? Did you call them thot popping? Yeah, those thot popping shrimps. <laughs> Cause they, they, they're looking sexy, man. Good people. I have my crab cakes. They look amazing. Yeah, that's some $50 crab cake right there, man. You ain't never lying. <laughs> so between what, that and this. What do y'all waitress tell you? She said, if you taste it and you don't like the first bite, don't you put your fork in there so eating another bite. you don't think it's $50, don't do it. She said, uh-uh, send it right back. Yep. But she said, it's good. So this is Hubby's. He got the seafood bait. Yeah, and man. And it looks really good. Yeah, let's see what she talking about. See if she tastes as good as she looks. Right. Hey. Well, I ain't nothing. Yeah, that's that's yeah, that that's good. stuff. You need you need the real stuff. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That look like a hot mm -hmm. Okay, that's good. Mm -hmm. So dig a little deeper. I'm trying to get some substance here. Oh, there that's, we go. That's a big sausage, man. Mm. Like, hey, watch the beard, man. It's mm -hmm. Prime real estate. It's good. Okay. It don't seem like it's the best, but it's good. Thank you, your crab cake. Baby, listen, I'm demolishing. I was going to save Those one for later. It, it's not going to happen. But this Greens good. need some work, but they're, they, they're edible. Yeah. Mm. All right, this is the aftermath, so yeah. I definitely need a box. It's definitely 
I said Stephanie, damn. <laughs> definitely. <laughs> it's the margarita. Uh -huh. I definitely need a box for that. <laughs> but these drinks right here? Yeah, baby. man. Baby. I'm so Yo. glad that we could sit here for a while because Yo. they played no games. Yeah. First sip, I knew that mm -hmm, this was, we were going to be here for a minute. For a minute. Got to be over here. Just never mind. Absolutely. 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 So, yeah, we made it back to the house, but we're about to run to the front desk because we ran out of coffee. The yeah, only man. thing that's left is that decaf skit. That ain't gonna do it, but yeah, listen, well, we don't, yeah, we don't do none of that light bulb skit, yeah. Listen, we had a waitress unto our own heart, man. She was like auntie for real. Yeah, we don't do that. We don't do that light uh -uh. bulb skit, right? They used to have light. But our um, waitress, her name was Rhonda. That's enough, <laughs> right there. But Rhonda ended up at Ooh. some point sitting beside us and having the whole conversation. Then she took and gave the tab to Stanley. She said, yeah, I can tell you ain't one of these these girls that come in here talking about so we going to split 50-50 or you going to take the tab. I said, oh, no. <laughs> I said, like them crab cakes that you sold me? At the top, it don't have no price on it. It said market price. I said, this right here? Market motherfucking price. She just walked off. She said, I can't. Mm -mm. She said, I cannot do this tonight. She said, I cannot do this tonight. Stanley almost Ooh. choked. Man, I couldn't even breathe, man. I couldn't yeah. even breathe. So we gonna pack up a little bit of stuff while we going out. Might as well make this trip down these steps work. Yeah, cause we out this jump tomorrow. In man. the morning, we out of here. Morning. So we see y'all when we get back. Hi right, y'all, it's that time. It's time yes. to go. We eating our last breakfast. When I said we on the nose. Yeah, check out time is at 10 o'clock. Look what time it is now. We just eating breakfast. <laughs> the good thing is you don't have to check out for real. You just drive out. Yeah, you ain't got to go back to the. So other. even if you're a few minutes late, you know. It's all check good. Us. Who will check us, boo? But yeah, man, we had a great time down here, man. Matter of fact, we ain't even ready to go home. <laughs> we, know, we looked at to another night, and I was like, another, and another night is like half of what we paid. Yeah, so it's like, no, nah, ain't even worth it. Ain't worth it. Yeah. Plus now everybody's starting to get antsy. Like everybody's starting to realize Lynette. He's out of town. So you got people calling 50 million times. I'm like, you don't call me on a normal day. Why are you calling me where we have to do Oh, yeah. So we're going to go ahead and eat this breakfast and we're going to catch y'all in the next freaking vlog. Straight from the VA. Chew up. Chew down. Holla. Tempo. Tempo. Can you keep up with my tempo? Tempo. Yeah, yeah, blowing up, see, fall I just hit the mic jacks on my tiptoes